Kyle Edmund took to the Australian Open show courts with Roger Federer to seemingly allay fears over a knee injury ahead of the first Grand Slam of the year. The British number one had cast doubt over his participation at the first Grand Slam of the year when he pulled out of his final warm-up event, the Sydney International, which is ongoing this week, because of the complaint. But today, on his 24th birthday, Edmund had an hour-long practice session with Federer, the defending Australian Open champion. Event organizers tweeted a clip of one particularly hard-hitting rally between the pair, which Federer won, after which a member of the 20 times Grand Slam winners team shouted, Happy Birthday! 2018 champion Federer took to the courts alongside Edmund. Getty images, during that particular session in Melbourne, where temperatures today hit 27 C, Edmund showed no signs of the injury which has troubled him early in 2019 ahead of an event where he reached the semi-finals a year ago. Edmund has just one competitive match to his name this season, the world number 14 having surprisingly lost in his opener is the Brisbane International against qualifier Yasu Taka Uchiyama before pulling out of the subsequent event in Sydney. At the time of his withdrawal, he said, I am disappointed that I won't be able to return to Sydney. I need to focus on my preparations for the Australian Open and do everything I can to be fit for the first Grand Slam of the season. There has been an element of the walking wounded among Britain's leading players heading into the first Grand Slam of the season. There are still doubts over the fitness of women's number one, Johanna Kanta, 24 hours after she pulled out of qualifying for Sydney with a neck complaint, was then included in the main draw as a lucky loser, only to then pull out of her match against Kiki Burtons. Andy Murray, meanwhile, has conceded he is some way off his best form and fitness nearly a year on from hip surgery in Australia. The British contingent suffered their first Australian Open setback on court today, when Gabriella Taylor suffered a 6-1, 6-1 qualifying round defeat to American Christian. Taylor was never in contention, going five games without picking up a single point. Her one positive was breaking on's opening service game in the second set, which provided only the briefest of respite for the Briton. Jamie Murray, meanwhile, got his 2019 off to a positive start with doubles partner Bruno Soares and Sydney, the pair winning 6-4, 6-4 against Santiago Gonzalez and Issa Mulha Qureshi. But Murray's Davis Cup teammate, Cameron Norrie, lost out with his New Zealand playing partner Ruben Statham 6-4, 6-2 to Joao Souza and Guido Pella, 24 hours on from an impressive singles win over Benoit Pair at the Auckland Open. More about, Kyle Edmund, Johanna Kanta, Andy Murray, Australian Open.